Alex, the Bridgegate trial getting underway. Bill Baroni, Bridget and Kelly, they're going to face the music. What do you got? Yeah, Bill, it's finally here. The Bridgegate trial entering the first day of picking the jury, which is going to be an important part of how this goes down. But the real news here coming from the lawyers for Bridget Ann Kelly and Bill Baroni, who say both their clients will definitely be testifying on their own behalf when the trial starts. Uh, they couldn't make it much clearer. Michael Critchley, Bridget Ann Kelly's lawyer, saying without a doubt, Bridget Ann Kelly will take the stand in her own defense. Michael Baldessari, lawyer for Bill Baroni, said plainly, Bill's going to testify and says his client wants to clear his name. Now, today, very little went on in the actual jury selection. We found out there are 253 people who have been called. Tuesday, the jurors will come back into the courtroom and be asked questions by both sides. Now, this trial revolves around the closure of the George Washington Bridge in September of 2013, allegedly as part of political retaliation. Part of that political retaliation the prosecution is going to try to demonstrate is retaliation against people like Jersey City Mayor Stephen Fulop. And Governor Christie's office lost a court battle on that score on Friday as a judge ordered the personal email of the governor to be searched to fulfill a public records request made by a newspaper who want to see the emails that Christie might have been CC'd on that canceled a meeting with Fulop, allegedly just part of that political payback culture that's going to be on trial here in Newark. So let me ask you, Alex, what, uh, what kind of move were the two attorneys in? I mean, are they looking at this as slam dunk? There's no way these guys should even be on trial. Uh, are they hinging it all on the tie-in to the governor or... Well, look, no lawyer ever thinks that a trial that they've got is a slam dunk. Uh, they have their strong opinions about the real narrative of this case, and they're not playing it out in the media right now. They're mostly keeping it to themselves. We're going to see what that defense is going to be as the trial unfolds. All right. Keep us posted. Thanks, Alex.